Lenny says there's more than one Spider-Man. That's all we need. An army of Spider-Man. You guys are new here. You do not want to be late with the shipment. Ever. The boss runs a tight ship. Not like shit. radius of that site. Gun running. Let's see what I can do to cut down the supply. You're fine! their buddies. Socks, in which case, buy some socks already. Place is locked down, Captain. Actually, webbed down. And someone finally reported shots fired, so I've got officers inbound. Good work.
Hey, doctor. Hello, Peter. I'll be just a minute. Wow. Look at all this new stuff. We really need to get better about organizing our workspace. Where did you get all this equipment? Called in every last favor. Took out a few loans. It's like we're starting over once again. But this time's going to be different. Our first volunteer subject, Lance Corporal Texador. Lost his arm overseas and now just wants to hug his daughter again. You've been busy. Just getting started. You know, until now, we've been looking at prosthetics from the wrong perspective. Why restore people to what they were when we can make them better? Okay, I think that should do it. You ready? Everything okay? Damn it! This is all your fault, Norman, you son of a... Well, I know who you're not voting for in the next election. Sorry. I uh, have a habit of making bad jokes in tense situations. <laughs> uh, it was a good joke, Parker. Just a bit of an overreaction on my part. No, don't worry. Uh, why don't you take a break? I'll, uh, I'll clean this up and uh, get us ready for another test. So, uh, hope you don't mind me asking, but it seems you and Norman have a bit of a history. We were lab partners in college. Became friends. Decided to start a business. We both had visions of changing the world just in different ways. Wait, you were at Oscorp when it started? I'm half the reason it's called Oscorp. In grad school, everyone called us the O's. <sighs> Add Corp to that and, well, it is a catchy name. Well, why'd you leave? Norman became more and more obsessed with genetics. He started a project I considered unethical. And there was this... Anyway, lawyers got involved. I chose to leave in exchange for a settlement. But that money didn't last very long. I've relied on grants ever since. If this project doesn't work... Don't worry. It'll work. Uh, let, me, let me just fix this up. I'll brew some fresh coffee. Be sure to run a diagnostic on the control unit. Could be a short. Huh. No good. Gotta reroute this circuit.
Oh, why don't you do the honors this time? I think we did it. Next step, neural interface. That's a lot of work for you to do by yourself. Sure you can handle it? Apparently not, judging by today's debacle. Because I still haven't found another job. My funds are still... I know. It's okay. Don't worry, I'll figure it out. What's a few bucks when you're trying to change the world, right? To changing the world. Call from MJ. Doctor, I need to go, but I'll be back later. Don't worry, the work will still be here when you get back. What's that? Hey, sorry I missed your call. Were you still on for dinner? Dinner? Oh, yeah. I was calling you about something else, but yeah, we should talk over dinner. Offer still stands for me to come over and cook. Oh, really? Well, I like to take risks. I'm still out, but I'll grab some stuff at the store and let you know when I'm home. Okay, talk soon. All right, dinner at MJ's. Low expectations. It'll be hard to screw this one up. I guess I'll just freelance for a while until she calls. Please don't touch the suit. You're crazy. I hate to bother you. You, but you can hang out here anytime. Lights back. Move left. I got an interesting tip today. Remember that barbaric beast named the Rhino? Apparently, last night he almost escaped from his cell in the raft. How you ask? Well, no one there seems to know, but they assure me he's been relocated to a more secure cell. Now, I'm no expert on Supermax prisons, but isn't the whole point of them that there isn't anything else more secure? I mean, he's a 700-pound maniac with an indestructible horn. If there's a more secure cell, why wasn't he in it? With this vial of the lizard's blood, I was able to mix up a cure and turn him back into Dr. Connors. Too bad it didn't last.
Hey, MJ. All right, I picked up a bunch of stuff at the store. Can't wait to see what you come up with. Swinging over now. Prepare to be amazed. You guys get great reception up here. Want me going in, which means I'm going in. Booyah! MJ, I'm at the third location. Apparently, it's casual mask day at the office. Finally, a job where you'll fit right in. Until you start with the face kicking. Yeah, I have a feeling HR is not going to be too happy with me. Literally didn't see that coming. like a perfect distribution network for drug runners, which it looks like is their real priority. You a thing of you. How do you backup guys get here so fast? I know it's not the six train.
Ugh, more demons. How do you guys tell each other apart? I mean, there's only so many mass variations. Ugh. MJ, I've got the place locked down. Great. I'll call in an anonymous tip. I bet if the police check out those drop boxes, they'll find something more interesting than secondhand jeans. Frightening thought. Oscorp does research and development for the military. Are the demons after experimental weapons? If I was a psychotic cult, I would be. I wonder where they got the idea. Hmm. What highly visible figure has made a career out of fighting madmen with lethal experimental technology like plate suits, tectonic gauntlets, and gigantic scorpion tails? No, 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 don't say the name! I just think. Hello, cat. Black cat does enjoy playing games with people, especially me.
here. You are not gonna believe what happened. So you know that address you gave me? I went there. <sighs> MJ. I know, I know, but wait. What is this? Just listen. This is the address Pete found. Men are all carrying firearms. What is this place? That office. Might be something inside that connects this to Lee. Need to get back there. Huh? What was that? What dumbass can't put their shit away? Bet it was happy. Almost shot a rat. Martin Lee's really paying the boss? Yeah. We built this war beast for Lee. Lee finances Yo, the boss's new boss, venture. You get in here. You we need to get into that office. Well. Boss sees that, he'll be pissed. You tried any What yet? are they building? Is this all for Lee? Only samples. The boss is still perfecting the recipe. Man, it's got a kick. What's going on? Hey, heard something. Easy does it. What kind of vehicle needs tires this big? Where is it? I swear I left it over here. Yo, has anyone seen the 316 socket driver? Hey, when do we get a new recent? I heard something. Am I hearing things? Hey, anyone pick up more beer after our last run? Where I heard something. Who is that? What is this? Some kind of military hardware? <sighs> Getting jumpy. Office must be to my right. I need to move careful through here. Yo, man. Why's the boss being so intense about putting GPS trackers on everything? Protecting trade secrets. Doesn't want any word on grave dust leaking out. Still, Bill's paranoid. Who asked you? Those Get barrels seem money. important. Alchemax. Why is that so familiar? What's in these? Notice? Ah! Cause it won't be there. God damn it! I said I'll fix it! Ah! Ah! You got some stones, Rick. <laughs> Let's see if they break. Such a disappointment. And now I need a new welder.
come on now. I hear something. I heard something. building for Lee. But why does he need an armored vehicle? There must be... Here we go. GPS trackers. What is Tombstone using these for? All right, boys. Time to move. Get the gear for my office. Time to go. Okay, I want to say don't ever do that again, but since I know you're going to anyway... Here. Take a few of those next time. Nice. Thanks. You know Tombstone is crazy and pretty much invincible, right? Everybody has their weakness. Mine is... whatever you're cooking right now. <laughs> it smells amazing. The chicken curry. Uh, just needs some time to simmer. No dumplings, I hope. You're never gonna let me live that one down, are you? Nope. <laughs> the great dumpling catastrophe. I still can't believe they evacuated the entire building. I know, and in January, too. <laughs> Your neighbors hated me. Yeah, they were pretty happy when we broke up. <laughs> yeah. So, let's talk about what you found in Lee's office. Well, Lee clearly has issues with Norman Osborne. Yeah, but, but why? I don't know yet. But his next move looks like it involves Devil's Breath, whatever that is. Yeah, I'll dig into it. So I was thinking, what if we teamed up? What, what, you want to be my sidekick? Like a spider girl? Spider woman. No. Woman. No, not a sidekick. A partner. Oh. Not again. Ah. Hey, it's your crime system thingy. Looks like a residential break-in. <laughs> Charles Standish. Hmm. That sounds familiar. Oh! Oscorp CFO! Wait. You don't think this has anything to do with Lee, do you? Sorry to cook and run. Did... Did you just leave your clothes on the kitchen floor? Uh... Where, where do you want me to, uh... Just which is fine. <laughs> See you later? Yeah. Hey, it's me. This curry is legit. So what do we know about Charles Standish? Let's see. Chief Financial Officer at Oscorp. Single. Known for his art collection. If Lee's after him, he's gotta be related to Devil's Breath. I'll run a search on everything in that file. Let me know the second you find something. I think Lee might be planning something even worse than City Hall. So, are we partners now? Cause it sure feels like we are. Partners! Uh, sounds good. Okay. See ya, partner. Police look like they could use some help. Catch it, lad! This is a Sanxi Yo Yo! 
There's probably more of them inside. You guys stay here. Somebody was in a hurry. Spider-Man! You're hurt. I'm okay. But you gotta find Mr. Standish, fast. Those guys in the masks kidnapped him and forced him up to his place. He lives in the penthouse, top floor. Okay, sit tight. This is up. Still is hot. So glad you're here. I can't find my car. I could have sworn I parked on this level. Fight! A for effort! The elevator won't work. They know I'm here. But maybe I can sneak up through the elevator shaft. Should be able to make it up to the penthouse from here. Take him out, Woody.
っている。电梯没有一层。Seriously? Standish. Okay, now what? Enter your password. He sounds nervous. I should take him out. Nap time. See that coming. Meizuo, Zizu Xia, just in there. Lights out. <laughs> Good one, Pete. Shh. Okay. 
Okay, all clear. Hope Standish is all right. Try this again. It's safe now. What were they after? Just financial records. About Devil's Breath? How do you know about that? Why do they want it? I don't even know what it is. Mr. Osborne's been pouring money into it for years, but he keeps the whole project a secret. I'm the only one who has any record of it. Not anymore. Looks like they copied some records to a secure server. Payroll information. On a Dr. Isaac Delaney. Who is he? I, I honestly don't know. Down! <laughs> Elevator shafts go, this is pretty nice. <laughs> hey, Yuri. You okay? Yeah. But I didn't get much out of Standish before these Sable guys stepped in and told me to back off. What's the deal? I get the sense all they care about is keeping him quiet. Because he knows about Devil's Breath. Right. Whatever the hell that is. I'm working on that. I think I just got a lead. A lead? You sound like a cop. Don't you mean... Spider Cop? Uh, Yuri? That's fair. What happened with Standish? He's safe. Okay, good. And the demons? They were looking for a name. You got a pen? Yeah, go. Dr. Isaac Delaney. Okay. Who is he? What's his deal? I was hoping you could tell me. I'm on it. Just give me a few. Oh, and before I forget, you left that tracker from Tombstones at my place. I'll drop it at Dr. Octavius's lab. I'll let you know what I find on Delaney.